The next report we need to budget for in the future is the budgeted income statement. So we've done the cash flow statement, which was just we're budgeting for inflows and outflows from operating, investing and financing activities. Uh, the budgeted income statement is simply just going to be our future guesses of revenues earned and expenses incurred to equal what we think our net profit will be. So when we do this report, we'll put the word budgeted at the start so we can see we've entered that up here. But otherwise, the format will stay the same. We will budget for our revenues in the future. We'll have our cost of goods sold, which will be our budgeted gross profit, uh, plus or minus any stock gains or stock losses or write downs. That'll be our adjusted gross profit. We'll then budget for any other revenues, so discounts or commissions, for example, or interest revenues. And lastly, we'll budget for any other expenses and we'll finally finish with a budgeted net profit. So the whole key to doing a budgeted income statement is remembering the difference between profit and cash. So what we want to do is remember for every transaction, is it going to be a revenue or an expense? Or is it going to be an operating, investing and financing activity? Or is it going to be both? So take for example revenue received, that would be a revenue. But because we've already received the money, that would be an operating activity. However, revenue that's been accrued, so earned but not yet received, that would be a revenue, but it wouldn't go on the cash flow statement yet. Looking at a prepaid revenue, that's where someone's paid me in advance for work I haven't done yet, that actually wouldn't be a revenue, but it would be an operating activity inflow. Take cash sales, quite simple, um, it's a revenue and an operating activity inflow. A credit sale, however, is going to be a revenue, but not an operating activity inflow. Collecting money from debtors is not a revenue, but it will be an operating activity. And we've got a whole bunch of transactions here, which we've done at one time or another. It's important for each of these. We won't we go through them now. For you to remember the impact of each on the income statement and also the cash flow. And a budget's no different. All we are uh, doing is just predicting the future. The impact of each transaction is identical. Um, and it's just all about can you allocate it to the right report.